This video is going to demonstrate the highs and lows of metal detecting and how trying something brand new got me my first gold coin. Late August, I had a day that I got 13 rings in one detecting session. It was crazy. Oh, and then came September. Let's just say it all evens out. Look at all these old trees here. Haven't been to new spots in a minute. Well, I guess that minute is up. Yeah, and you did absolutely fantastic there. Listen, we pull a gold coin by the end of this video, but this was quite the ride. Uh, new York has a vast amount of parks and playgrounds, and uh, this is one I've never been to before, and we're going to see how it goes. It went like crap. Let's summarize it in one minute. Hey, shut up, Meryl. Dig, quarter. Whole bunch of angry ants. They're like, why'd you destroy my home for clad? Time, the most hated thing in metal detecting. You got this coiled piece of metal here. That's great, but you're not Nikola Tesla. Nickel, quarter. It's a hot rock. Don't burn yourself. One of the really old pull tabs, vintage, old junk. Ring of the wrong type. We got some silver. Silver is phenomenal, but you know what? We're all competing against videos like this. His pinpointer leads him to a rock. He does some unnecessary climbing. He finds the target that he planted there minutes before. The anticipation and the reveal. Then you get some fake salivating and heavy breathing noises. Now it's time for shaking hands. 56,000 people have already hit the like button. That's more than my entire channel. Drop the diamonds and then title the video that I'm the richest man on the planet. Oh, and this is the good part. Then you get people like Shane in the comments who are like, can you confirm if this is real? Shane fails at tasks like boiling water and at life. So no, Linda, Roosevelt dimes are not going to cut it for the majority of the YouTube audience. But anywho, Rosie, there we go. Quarter and penny. Yeah, great. Wow, super deep. Stay classy, New York. Washer. That's a calm one. Hello, Mr. Oh. There goes the shoe. I see it. I was about to say hello, Mr. Crab. There's Mr. Crab. We have, this is a miracle. Oh, I thought I lost my shoe. Yeah, September was about the little victories, like getting your shoe back, getting a random ring, you know, adding to your collection. Nobody finds hordes of treasure all in one place, okay? You put it together a little bit at a time, and uh, that's the joy in it. We make our own treasure boxes. And as you saw, <laughs> this month was more about getting hit with rogue waves than finding treasure and sometimes that happens this was a fun day but l l let's turn this one into a minute too we got a gold coin coming oh it's raining i don't care i need to dig we're going to the beach i'm meeting up with indiana tones let's go oh i see mr tones down the beach it's mr tones touchdown interesting piece of debris what in the world is this? We got a coin. Memorial penny. It's a big piece of junk. Just a coin. Oh my god, we have like a tumbled down space peanut. Snap. Great. Mr. Cohen's got something. What did you get me? Oh! There's Pandora on it. It's green. Oh! Pandora! Pandora the Explorer. Man, this weather is rough. Look at that. All of the conditions were right. You saw black sand on the surface. It's a beach that we've been to before and have had a good amount of success. But you know what? Sometimes it doesn't happen. There's no such thing as a bad day metal detecting. Like, that's all in your mind. You make it a bad day. If you get discouraged when you don't find something... You're not going to like metal detecting. I often don't release the videos of the days where I find next to nothing, but that doesn't mean that I don't have them. 
And it definitely doesn't mean I don't have fun. Oh yeah, and that brings us to the storm, the, the most flooding that New York City has seen in decades. Wouldn't that bring great metal detecting conditions? Yeah, it's the day after a massive rainstorm in New York City. I mean, historic rainstorm. And where am I? Of course, I'm at the beach. Every field, every park is in puddles right now. But uh, the beach, oh, these are ideal conditions for metal detecting the beach. So let's see what we get. I could see a cut down the beach. I'll show you in a moment. But what I like better than a cut is when the waves go far back on the beach and that was the case yesterday you could see with this weed line oh we got something right here oh look at there that's an interesting start right there this is going to be silver and uh, this might have actually been a, a dry drop uh with the way well i see some uh black in there that's a cool ring what is that we got to take a close look at that first signal I don't know was that pushed in I don't know um hasn't been in the water long this might be a late summer uh, by the look of it silver tarnishes pretty fast and just by the look of this this is probably a dry drop you got a little bit in here of um, discoloration what is that from aliens I don't know but I think the best conclusion was this was a dry drop instead of a product of push-in. All right, watch this. This is very unique. You don't normally feel this. Look at this soft sand that you have up top. What happened was you had a lot of runoff at the beach and it was running off from the dry down here. So that ring actually could have been deeper uh, than it was. Everything just got pulled in here and I see a very flat, bottom of the beach so let's summarize this in a sentence big rains come sand gets pushed down from dry into wet where Merrill normally hunts deep signal here uh, we're still high on the beach in this section where the sand is soft this thing could get signals to China it's a dime <laughs> we're going days too deep uh, yeah that is uh, that's a good I'd say 18 inches Everything was buried. So let's summarize and get to the bonanza part. Sea debris, this was dredged in. This was the year of the dredge. Gorgeous zinc specimen, dredge junk. Quarter. I see you. What are you? Oh, somebody's a member of the NRA. <laughs> this is a pendant. Yeah, here's some of the cut uh, that's left, but you could see uh, from the runoff, yeah, this might have been two different events, actually. You know, you have a cut here, and it's all filled up with sand. Quarter. Ah, uh, dredge junk. Deep. I think we did it. I think we did it. Got some green on there. Hey, that could be a lower... Could be like a 10K. Oh, is this sushi worthy? That's the question. The tradition here is you get gold you get sushi now this plated this is going to be plated it's very light always happy to have a ring don't get me wrong the sushi is coming oh snap look at this this is going to be a dollar coin that's susan b Meh. 85 probably zinc oh what do we have here this might be a foreign coin. You want a perfect summary of my September? This is a zinc doubloon. You can't make this stuff up, okay? This is a zinc doubloon. Silver wouldn't look like that. Look at the white in here. And it's stamped of some sort. It, yeah. Yeah, that was September. I googled fake pirate coins. Oh, look what the number one result was right here. Who does this? So why have I been making less videos? Oh, that's easy. The school year is on. September also brought back to work. You know, summer's over and uh, back to work. 
you're gonna see me, but you're gonna see me less than in the summertime when I could go like all night metal detecting and did that many times. So October happened, thankfully, and uh, I decided to try something brand new. I joined a metal detecting club and I went to my first event and it was awesome. Dr. Otek, it is good. All right, so this, <laughs> this is good. I, I you like you put the two dots. On so we are at a Staten Island History Hunters event. I just joined my first metal detecting club. So I did my first seated hunt, and for the longest time, I would joke around and be like, "How's that different than an Easter egg hunt?" All right, one coin whisperer. One. That's awesome. Two. Bowling. And we're learning now, knots. Two half hitches. Two half hitches. Thanks, two half Mike. Hitches. See, look, that'll stay. All right, now, Merrill. Yes, sir. Steak, please. Uh oh. Steak. Go, Hold Merrill. Go. Well. All right, give now, me a hammer. Hammer, hammer. Hammer, hammer. Hammer. <laughs> go. Scalpel. <laughs> ah! Come on. We got it. We got it. All right. What? 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 What is this, Lou? This is a New York bonsai tree. Oh my god. It's a bonsai tree. Miyagi! <laughs> hey, Miyagi! Very often you see me fly solo, metal detect solo, sometimes in the middle of the night. And there's a peace to that, but there's also a joy to friendship. Dog Star Blazer in the house. How are you, sir? I'm good. Excited. Nervous. <laughs> Is, is, is this your first club too? Yes. Just like me? Yes. Me, oh, yeah. we're, we're club Boom. rookies together, sir. Yes. Oh, it's good to see oh, you, brother. I'm green. <laughs> me too. Here's a metal detecting joke for you. The, the, the simplex guy was really swinging the CTX 3030. If you metal detect, you understand that. That's a metal detecting joke. It's the new generation. <laughs> It's the new generation. He's gonna, it's he's gonna atrophy. Because it's light. It's light. That was a metal detecting joke. Yeah, wait till it's all set and done. Then it'll. Oh, we got Garrett's. I must have taken a lot of phone calls to get all of this, a lot of work on the back end. Yep. Great job. This is the last metal detecting club in New York City. And uh, Mike and Lou, uh, Indiana Tones is Lou. Uh, they worked extra hard securing all sorts of prizes. Now, how do they get those prizes? They call for sponsorships. That's one way. And in terms of the prizes from the seeded hunts, every penny that was raised, it costed $100 to uh, get into the hunt. Uh, every penny gets reinvested in the fine. So you might find like these silver leaves. They're not real silver. And you, you, anything, anything you, they're like metal things. They're called cotton. Like you, you give them in at the end, then you get tickets to give redeem prizes. Yeah, if you found a silver leaf, you would get uh, tickets. There were also these silver hearts that were worth uh, five raffle tickets, and they were raffling off metal detectors and all sorts of equipment, digging tools, you name it. Anything you get put in your pack, don't look at it, just keep going. Gotcha. So at the end, that's gonna amount to prizes and stuff? Yeah. Cool. You know, that was my, my next question. Doing this. Got Jeff here. We got a good turnout. Nice little event. You're gonna find different colored pennies out there, okay? There's also, Wheat pennies out there for you to keep. These are the trade-ins. Wheat pennies are there to prevent cherry picking. Okay? You want a cherry pick? Well, listen. You got a cherry pick. You got to miss the regular. They just asked what's cherry picking. <laughs> Digging turtle in the house. <laughs> All right, so brought the dais. You want to run one frequency on this. I'm going 17. And that should work. I'm going to lower my sensitivity because there's going to be a lot of people in a small square, small rectangle out there. Say hi. Hi. Now you <laughs> say is, hi. Uh, hello. How are you? <laughs> this is Rachel. <laughs> Let's go. 
So I thought I was filming the start of this. Apparently I wasn't. But it started and we'll just jump right in. I got a feather. I could actually hear the difference and that actually helps. I think this is going to be a weedy. Yeah, it's a penny made of wheat. Folks, Barry is here. Make sure that you fill your holes. It's intense. Oh, snap. Well, that's cool. Look at this. This is intense. This is intense. Oh, my mind lab pinpointer is letting me down. Oh, I'm letting myself down. I didn't change the battery. Nice going, Meryl. I don't know what this means, but they spray painted it yellow. Wheat, go, go, go. Pinpointer, pinpointer. That's why you change your battery in your pinpointer, people. Wheat's up. Go, go, go. Yeah, a lot of people are skipping the wheat scents. Smarty pants, look at this, look at this. Penny made of wheat. Wheat. Oh, look at that. We got a silver thingy. This puts us in a raffle. Wheat. Hey, they said that they removed all the iron. Oh well. Oh snap. Got another golden one. Wheat. 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 Oh snap. Feather, feather. Oh. Another yellow penny. Another yellow penny. So it quickly became time to head back and uh, claim the first set of prizes. Standing. Mr. Jeff, how did you do? I did all right. I got some a uh, little of everything. Me too, man. I'm Me too. Happy. That's good. I got a feather. I had this way it's all I about me. I got a heart. I got a feather. I got some yellow spray painted Me coins. Too. Yeah, I think that means something. I always knew you had I got a heart. Blue. I got blue. And Thank yellow. you, Mr. Blazer. <laughs> How'd you do? Pretty good. I got I got a couple of feathers, but I'm not a duck. <laughs> I'm a mole. You're the mole. That's right. <laughs> I got some colored coins see too. What I got yep. yet. Yep. I got a nail and a ribbit. Uh, nail and a ribbit. 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 Yeah, uh, that, that's right. They were supposed to clear it out. I guess. Sorry, I got two blues. I guess and that's two proof yellow. that we, we miss that when we swing. I, I think they were just. Ooh, oh, I got blue three one. blues, uh, three blues, and two yellows. I didn't know that blue was a thing. I got a bunch of yellows. Line here because we've got to be orderly. So, this is what in I an got. Orderly fashion. Please line up in an orderly fashion. Go ahead. You go ahead. You got to hold it. No, I don't want to go. The wings, the wings will do right after that. We'll grapple tickets. We redeem them and the hearts. Right? So, we're trading these in. We keep the wheat scents. We're trading all the different stuff the yellows, the wings. In the heart, we're trading for something. We're about to see what we get. Whoa, look at what Jeff got. <laughs> the moon is a good one. Wait, what was the moon? It's a half, half it's moon. It, He's got one. Yeah, oh. you get it. You get a uh, right there. Yeah, half that's it. You get one of these. The half oh, moon is, is like this Ooh. special. You get to, look at this guy. Oh. What? Yeah. What? what? It's matching your <laughs> necklace. Look at that. It's cool, right? right? Good stuff, man. Right. Boom. Hey. Boom. Hey. All right. See the Asaya here. What do I got? All right. So you got four. Got four. four silver dimes. So I'm going to give you a three oh, pack. I'm going to feel at home. Merck. Yeah. <laughs> right. yeah. So that's four. Right. Awesome. Right. Thank you. All right. Any wow. other pennies? No, right. everything else is. Uh, right. yep. And that's worth five raffle right. tickets. Those are each worth a raffle ticket. Right. Wow. That's really cool. Uh, we need to use the key. All right. Great. Somebody come around. Thank you. Sweet. Nice yeah. Go well. You that one. Oh, that, absolutely. <laughs> more, more rap. <laughs> that is how you kill it on a hunt right there. 
Wow. That's so cool. There were a total of three seated hunts uh, that happened that day, uh, but uh, there was plenty of time to hang out too. And we got New York pizza. <laughs> the bees invited themselves. Yeah, there's a bee problem. All right, let me. Be gone, bee. New York pizza has been unlocked. We need a giant industrial van. Thank you, guys. Mr. Toads. Let's see what he has. He has a total of eight. Oh, snap. Five and one each. Wow. One, two, three, four, five. Now, here comes the rules for the seated gold hunt. This is what's on the back of the penny, very tiny. Oh, Jesus. Okay. On the back if of it. If you have glasses or need to see, <laughs> I I'm giving you a hint. Take your glasses with you. On this hunt, you want to look at everything you find. I'll be out there with the box. First come, first serve. Whoever oh, says, got it, come over, show me it. You get first, first pick. pick. Second pick. Yes. Second pick. Make Listen. sure you pick the big one. You guys are lucky. I haven't been at an no, uh, optional hunt yeah. that had nine pieces of gold in it in years. Wow. The more people that join, the more gold goes in there. All the money goes back into the hunt. Whoever picks the Mickey, you get you get this with it. I just didn't want to take up the whole box with it. And your Disney trip. Do you see anything you like? Oh, yeah. Here's what the stamp looks like. Make me enlarge enough for everybody to see. It's U.S. and Anchor Smile. You're the coin of this. Just here, just here. It's in here. We just yeah. dropped nine of them in here. Come on. Oh, wow. This is what it looks like. Yeah, yeah, but still. Yeah, it's about on. to get real. Uh, we got Team Lynch over here. And hey, this is where it's getting real. It's the gold hunt. Yeah, they got nine uh, pieces of gold planted. No, it's not planted. They've got pennies everywhere. And the pennies are stamped. And uh, if you get a stamped penny, then uh, you could trade it in for gold. But you have to check the pennies. And uh, you have to identify them. And as soon as you get one, you run over to them. It was go time, but I missed the opening whistle because I, I was ready to go. I wanted a gold coin. I think I got one. Got one, Meryl. Yep. One we I figured at this point all of the gold coins were gone. Got one. Seven. Two left. Seven out. Oh, jeez. Oh, uh, I'll take that one. Okay. Yeah, okay. Nice. Is this my gold coin? Yes, gold coin. I got a gold coin. What did we unlock? What did we unlock, you say? Unlock. Sushi. I don't know. <laughs> the Too dance much. is celebrating. Too much, Paul. Too much. Got gold. It's nice my gold coin. coin. Sweet. I didn't think that this would be uh, left. Go, Meryl, go. Oh my God. That's awesome. Right. Thank God. <laughs> Good you, Meryl. Thanks, buddy. Go into a gold bar gold coin. It's got a four-leaf clover on the back. This is a quick and friendly reminder to please hit that subscribe button. As of right now, over the last 28 days, 65% of the people who watch my videos are not subscribed. 
please support the channel, hit that subscribe button. Alright, I'm done. Leave the rest of the gold to somebody else. Good job, Deus. I got a gold coin. Dogs. Let's take a look. Upside down. Whoa. Sweet. Sometimes you gotta be a little open-minded and we're not trying to quantify here. We're trying to have fun. I had a blast. I had an absolute blast. So Barry Bonds has an asterisk next to his home run record for the steroids and all that. I know this wasn't exactly from the ground, but it was a phenomenal day. Looks like Jeff got one. Hey. The other one, the other one had more gold, but I had to choose uh, gold coin. I had to. <laughs> Misa, can I say what you got? Yeah. yeah. Nice job. Yeah. Guys, some guys are like, why are you leaving? I'm like, because it's fair, man. It's fair, exactly. Oh yeah. Plus, I get this shot. Look at this shot. Look at that. This is a million dollar shot Look right that. here. We got gold, That's right. That's right. We got oh, sushi. Yeah. Sushi. Sushi. Come on, come on. Find it. I want one left. <laughs> and you get the Mickey gift certificate there. Out. Out. Nice. Everybody Congratulations. There was one more seated hunt. Let's make this one quick. How you doing? I think Good. we cleaned this up. Look at this. These guys are killing it. <laughs> killing it. This was just this one. <laughs> Wow. Awesome. Scale of 1 to 10, how fun was this? I would give it a 10. Yep. Fun. A lot of fun. What about you? Scale of 1 to 10. Oh, I have fun. I love this. Yes. One to He's going to go with ten. a 10 as well. Yeah, yeah. Ten. yeah. That's 10s across the board. 10s across yes. the board. 10. Yes, oh, yeah. yes definitely. Ten. This was awesome. epic. Yeah. What a great day. Birds of a feather. Yep. Wow, yep. Yep. Together. Yep. Yep. <laughs> Nobody left empty handed. And uh, to finish things up, it was raffle time. There you go. Thank you. Pick yep. up, please. All right. The next prize a $100 gift certificate for any Extreme Scoop product. That's yours. Oh, wow. Whoa. Thank you, guys. Thank you. 683-159. They make a phenomenal product, but uh, how's the irony on that? <laughs> Look at what Carlos got. First time. Yeah, man. Really cool. I also won something that would totally get me arrested on a plane. I just won this. Grave digger tools. Oh, there he goes again. Whoa. And these guys got a lot to give away. What a great day. So I'm going to leave you with the Staten Island History Hunters Metal Detecting Club's Facebook group. I'm also going to link to all of the YouTube channels that were there on this great day. Metal Detecting... You know, we recognize and remember the treasures that we find, but the number one thing that we forget is those treasures can be the people in our lives. That's why you might want to join a metal detecting club. Thanks for watching, everybody.